Hi guys, welcome once again to the channel. Esoteric Cloud Surfer here, ready to take another attempt in the online ladder of Pokemon VGC Sword and Shield, right? So let's go guys, I hope you are ready for another today, challenging the ladder today, again with the Calyrex Ice Rider, again with the Torkoal, with the, with the Mimikyu, with the Rillaboom, with the Ndidi and the Tapu Fini. I remember on the last episode, I remember I thought, ah, the um, Mian Shao is going to be a good switch of the Tapu Fini, but I ended up not doing it. But remember that we also have Pokemon Unite live streams and Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX almost every day in the channel, okay? So, and remember that you can join our Discord by following the link in the description below by searching for Ezosu Gaming or just request me a link. All right, so let's get into today's episode. Let's get it. Just here, trying to sit in the best position possible with my back real straight. Okay, let's go. Okay, first trainer of the day. And he is... Oh, Kyogre team with no Serena, but uh, Registeel there. Torkoal is good into the Registeel. Tapu Fini as well. Mm -mm -mm. So they can Tailwind with the Tornadoes. Trick Room is very good for us. We don't have really a way to deny it if we go Mimikyu Rillaboom. Right. So Mimikyu Rillaboom, Calyrex. Torkoal is better if we can get rid of the Landorus and we, we can take the Rain away. I'm just... Torkoal is specifically for the Registeel. Specifically. Oh, but they lead Registeel right off the back. So they want to start um, to boost it earlier as possible. So here they protect or switch Kyogre out. I think they will not stay in to eat a grassy glide. Now the thing is, what do they do with the Registeel? They protect, they start to boost. We have Charm to reduce the attack, but I think they're not going that way. And we fake out. Registeel, because they are going to switch the Kyogre, right? They are going to switch or to protect the Kyogre, so we can just fake, fake out the Registeel. Because in that way, yeah, in that way the, we continue with the Mimikyu's disguise activated. They can fake out Rillaboom next turn, that's fine. Let's go fake out there. Awesome. Yeah, they can't. That's uh, one list, one, le one turn list that they set up. All right, so we have Trick Room. It's good for us. Maybe here we switch the Mimikyu into the Torkoal? No. That will make Incineroar's move stronger. Because Mim Mimikyu is not doing much. We can play rough the Incineroar and knock off into the Incineroar to take whatever item he has. Because he will fake out one of us. Yeah, the, the Rillaboom, the only one he can fake out, right? And they start to go for iron defense. We, we really need the Torkoal on the end game. Okay? Because they are not seeing the, the Torkoal coming. So they are not building up special defense onto the Registeel. And that is the item of the Registeel, by the way. I think we're just going to waste our turns here. So I want Calyrex back in, and we must preserve 
the Rillaboom as well to the Kyogre, right? I just don't want to waste my turns of Trick Room like that. A parting shot into the Rillaboom to bring in the Kyogre. Now they bring their own Rillaboom, so they can fake out this turn. They send Tomb. Okay. We remove Rillaboom item. It is. It was a Salt Vest. That's good for our Torkoal on the end game. And now we can take Regilek, uh, Registeel items. Registeel item. Well, Sun Tooth does good damage. Yeah, we, we just have two turns of Trick Room, it makes no sense. So I want to protect there, add Knock Off there. Yeah, the Fake Out there. There is no new. The R and Defense again. Knock off. We take the leftovers, nice. This one is going to be a long one. So here I want to switch the Mimikyu in and just glacial lens and bring the Mimikyu back in. We can also Willow Wisp the Reggie Steel, but no, with the with the Torkoal on the field, we want to always um, hit wave. The Intimidate there. The Intimidate is being very annoying. Oh, but we have the White Herb, which is good. Ah, it's not very effective. So, still good damage, not going, not going to lie. And they use another iron defense. We just can't bring Torker freely, because then they just bring the Kyogre and we have nothing to do about that. So, now we protect the Calyrex and we Trick Room. No more grass, okay. So, protect Calyrex. Trick room with the Mimikyu. The thing is now we are in a better position to knock out the Incineroar next turn with a higher power. They use Centum to the Mimikyu. Is that breaking these guys? Yes, it is. Okay. So they didn't go for fake out. I thought they did use darkest lariat. Ah, that sh that shouldn't be a knockout. But they, they do go for the right play, doubling up into the Mimikyu. I could have just uh, higher power the Incineroar here. And the next turn we would win the uh, the Incineroar against the Incineroar, not the whole match. Okay, so huge game here. They are winning. They are using their strategy against our own and here I want to double up into the Incineroar because then our Rillaboom is quite free we get an attack boost if we... I know but the, the Mimikyu will knock it out do they suspect high horse power they can change into Rillaboom Okay, they change into the Rillaboom, okay. A 
I just still protect, so that's fine. Critical hit, higher power, let's go. No, okay. Play rough, intimidated though. Good damage, even though we are intimidated. Right. So here, I can just, no, I think they will fake out. They can Grassy Glide the Mimic you for damage. I want to Glacial Lance, but they can just fake out Calyrex and go in and attack him to Mimic you. So I want to protect it. And I want to bring our own Rillaboom in now that accomplish nothing. On the next no, on the next turn I can fake out. But Mimic is not helping us anymore here, right? Especially against Kyogre with the double with the spread damage. So let's go for a Shadow Sneak into Rillaboom. Just to keep doing some more damage. They f yeah, they fake out, so we were right. And we Shadow Sneak. Not doing much. They Body Press. I'm good. So we could have. We could have. Um, play rough with the Mimikyu there. So here, I think I want to. Hire Power. Because we might switch into the Incineroar and we catch that switch in. Come on, let's go. This this game is taking too long. The thing is, Reggie still has the body press. Then we threw Rillaboom into the Incineroar. We read that. But now the Mimikyu has two Intimidates on it. I think this is not enough. They protect, nice. We go for higher power. Ooh, it's not enough. Yeah, it's not enough. Now they can fake out. The thing is, now I can catch them with uh, Lushal Lens on switch ins. That Sand Tomb is annoying. Okay, what we, we have Rillaboom and Torkoal in the back. I want to protect here so they don't fake out Body Press. I think Shadow Sneak is not enough as well. Right? Turns of Trick Room. Last, last turn of Trick Room, so I want to play rough the Incineroar, in case the Mimikyu survives. The Shadow Sneak is not doing enough there. We protect, I think they read into that, it's very obvious. No, they don't read into that, they just fake out, body press. They send to again, good coverage. Oh, but we survive, and let's go play rough. Nice! <laughs> the Mimikyu survives! So clutch, so good Mimikyu! Thank you! But the thing is, now they bring the... Ah, but we can bring the Torkoal! And then there is no rain! Ah, and we are free! So now we can we have double trick room again. But let's see what I wanna do. They bring the Kyogre in. And I want another trick room. The thing is, now if we get rid of the Kyogre, which we can with the Rillaboom, we win with the Torkoal. So we, we really don't need the Calyrex here. Right, so the Trick Room is over. Right, I want to set up the Trick Room. And bring the Torkoal. Because they are going to use the Water type attack. And the body press into Calyrex. Do we survive that? I don't know. I'm not sure.
Let's go, we bring the sun. They use the water spout. Still, still, he still does a lot of damage. Okay, we lose. Torkoal is knocked out. I thought, I thought, I thought Torkoal could survive there. And they body press. That should do. Oh, enough. Okay, we lose there. Even in the sun, it KO the Torkoal. I mean, it's not a total lose. I mean, it is because the Mimikyu is so low health, right? We needed the Torkoal to win against the Re against the Registeel. So here we ah they must protect. They must protect with the Kyogre here, but Trick Room is not good. I mean, it, it's kind of good for us, but now it's not that important. Let's double up into the Kyogre. We 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 lost to the Registeel. We have no damage into it. Then we threw into their own Rillaboom, yeah. Okay. I think we can knock it out, though. Huge damage. Play rough. Nice. If we just... Oh, and we, he avoids... Mimikyu wins. Mimikyu avoids that attack there. If we just have the Torkoal in the in this end game, we, we win against the Registeel. We didn't use uh, Calyrex very well because they always have good switch ins for Glacial Lance and higher powers. So Shadow Sneak, Grassy Glide into the Kyogre. Now they protect. Yeah. And they... Okay. No, yeah. We go first. And Grassy Glide. And he goes for a Sand Tomb. Into the Mimikyu. Okay. Let's see if uh, one, if the Grassy Glide can one-shot the, the, the Kyogre here. That should be good, good information for the future. It is enough for one hit, one hit knockout, but they win with the Registeel, they, they just body press. Yeah, we needed the Torkoal, so in that turn I think we just sack the Mimikyu and we go for a Trick Room. Now, yeah, we need to sacrifice Mimikyu and the Calyrex to win there. So yeah, that's about, that's about it. Cool first game though. Registeel, very hard to knock out when it starts to um, set up right. Okay, let's go. Next game of the day. Let's go! We have found our next trainer. Okay, let's see. 
he's rocking a Zashian theme, but with tornadoes as well. That Landorus is very dangerous. They have the Urshifu. I think that's Water Urshifu for fire types. Right? So we want Trick Room every day. Because then with Trick Room, either Torkoal or Calyrex are very good against the Zashian. Right? So Mimikyu and Didi. Because if they. Mimikyu Rillaboom is also good for fake out pressure. And then Trick Room. Or Calyrex, Rillaboom. No, they can lead Incineroar. They can lead the Urshifu as well. Or even the Landorus and do great damage. So then I want the Calyrex here. And the Torkoal seems the best option. Let's go. Okay, but does he leave Urshifu, Tornadus? Ah, I predicted it before he brought it, okay. So what, what do we, oh, the Rillaboom is water type, as I suspected. So they can double up into Mimikyu. So ah, they can Surging Strikes, that's true. That's where Fake Out comes. They can taunt. They can taunt with the tornadoes. Right? So what about we just double up into the Urshifu? They protect. That's fine if they go for a taunt. Rain dance. We could have just trick room there easily. So now they know we want to double up into them. Maybe maybe now they switch to the Incineroar. If they have <coughs> the Incineroar, they switch into it. So they want to knock out the Mimikyu here, right? How fast is our Mimikyu? No speed investment, the Urshifu should be way faster. Okay, we can Shadow Sneak. Ah, but, but they, they might switch. I just want to get rid of the Urshifu, so I want to Shadow Sneak Grassy Glide. They withdrew, damn it, into, the, into their own Rillaboom. Two turns where I could have trick room with no problem. I just don't. Still good damage here with aggressive light. It's a more bulky Rillaboom. And the Hurricane into the Rillaboom. Damn it, that's super effective. Okay, okay. So I want now the Calyrex. And we protect Trick Room. They still might have Taunt. No, they have Rain Dance, Hurricane, Tailwind, Protect. So we can safely here protect Trick Room and Protect. Because they will fake out the, um, the Calyrex here. They can double up into the Mimikyu. So it will be better to, to Glacial Lance just to cover that. If they double up into the Mimikyu, they just lose. Both, both Pokemon with the Glacial Lance. That's why they are not going to do that. They're not d doubling up into the Mimikyu. Okay, nice. Not doubling up. Zashin. We can charm the, the Zashin. 
I don't know we have charm here. They fake out perfect. You got trick room setup and Mimikyu in the perfect position to support. So here we want to knock out the Zashin the fastest possible, right? So charm and higher power. Seems good to me. They can substitute. They can always Grassic Live. Then we threw the Rillaboom. They bring the Urshifu. Okay. We did not Glacial Lance, chill. Huge damage. Now we Charm. Nice, and they Behemoth Blade, the Calyrex, also they can Aqua Jet, right? Good damage, not enough. Another higher Power will kill, but I think they protect here. I want to play rough the Urshifu every day, so then we can Shadow Sneak. They switch. Because I think the Glacial Lance it's not enough. If they switch into the Rillaboom, how much turns of grass left? This is this will be the last one, so they should not switch now. If they switch into the Rillaboom, good for us. They can switch into the Landorus to eat that um, high horse power. Right? So play rough into Urshifu and Glacial Lance to cover Rillaboom switching and Tornado switching. Urshifu protects and no switch in. God damn it! No, they double protect. What? They are. Hmm. They are going to switch now? The rain stopped. So Urshifu is less dangerous here. No grass. So now they can bring the real boom safely. I still want three, two turns of trick room. So I still want to play rough. And the thing is, I, I really I, I don't really don't want to wards power. Because if the Urshifu is focus sashed, I want to break that as well. And if they switch either, they're gone. So let's see what, what, what can we do here. We can Crit on Zashin and get a knockout there. They're, they're in a tough position. My team is good against their team. You have Trick Room up. The, the, the Zashin has been charmed. He's one attack lower because he... The Aqua Jet. Hoping to, to crit there. Maybe. Zashin will be knocked out by a Shadow Sneak next turn. Oh, it's not enough to knock out the Urshifu. Is that enough to knock out the Calyrex? It is not, but the Aqua Jet is. <clears throat> so, Shadow Sneak into Zashin. Or... Or... Shadow Sneak into Urshifu, protect the Calyrex, but we, no, we need Trick Room, we need Trick Room to win, but we have in the back, Torkoal, oh, so yeah, Shadow Sneak into Urshifu, protect the Calyrex, in course, we protect, fine, Urshifu also protects, And Zashen also protects. Okay. The Shadow Sneak. Now we Shadow Sneak again and we bring the Torkoal in. 
So then we can trick room next turn. Because next turn we are pressuring the Zacian. And the Rillaboom in the back. If they switch out now. Maybe it was better to knock out Zacian here right away. No, because this way a Turkle never dies. And if we knock out Zacian they can Surging Strikes or Aqua Jet into the Turkle. Calyrex come back. Torkoal come in. I think this was a great turn to Trick Room though. We Shadow Sneak the Urshifu. So they sack the Urshifu there. The Behemoth played into the Mimikyu. That will be their best play. No, but it is into the Torkoal. Doing no damage. Okay. Now they bring... The Tornadus. Now, it will be a great time to use that taunt that you, you didn't show. If you have it. Right, so I'm a Trick Room here. And just Heat Wave. Because they still have the Grassy Glide on the Rillaboom, so they can win even uh, under Trick Room, because our Calyrex is really low, really low health. Oh, nice! They forfeit. They thought they, they had no way around that, so awesome! Great victory. We played really well. We're, we're always positioning ourselves into the best position, and the Mimikyu Charm was great, and we knocking out the, the Urshifu was great, great for us as well. So. Great game, let's go to the next one. Okay, let's go, let's see. Jake. Kyogre Kabutops. Kabutops with Swift Swim, right? So here, very important, the Rillaboom, but they have redirection on the NDD. And on the Among Us, Rillaboom is great here because it's good on the Regileki because of priority Grassy Glide on the Rillaboom. I think they didn't bring Kabutops here, we have, we have Rillaboom. On the Kyogre, on the Regileki, it's good because we can avoid Rage Powder and Spore from the Among Us. So Rillaboom goes first. Rillaboom, Mimikyu, Calyrex, Tapu Fini. Is also very good for the Landorus. Ah, but they might have Sludge Bomb there. But we are under Trick Room. But we lose for the Regilecki as well. Our Indeed is good. What's the, the spread on our Indeed? Ah, it has some special attack into it. Okay. But Tapufini is good to the Landorus to set Misty Terrain so we don't get put to sleep. And just because it's Tapufini, I think that's valuable. Just being her herself. Let's see, maybe they'll leave Kabutops. After all, they, they bring Kabutops out of nowhere. Even though we have Rillaboom in the team. It's Landorus Regilecki. So I think we fake out Landorus. So if he does not sludge bomb us. I don't want that. And then I think we just set up Trick Room nicely. Okay. Fake out Landorus. Trick Room. They might bring the Among Us right in. That's fine. We fake out the Landorus. Good damage. Was that a crit? No. They Volt Switch. Yeah, they bring the... They bring the that's a crit. Yeah, that's a crit. They bring the Among Us right now. That's fine. I think we Grassy Glide the Landorus and we switch in the um, Tapufini. So we, they can... 
Now they bring Kyogre. Okay. What you wanna do with that? Bait aggressive line and sludge bomb. Is that it? So I want to double up into the Landorus and play rough into it as well. I please don't protect. If I think they're going to protect with Kyogre to bait aggressive line and then they they sludge bomb our Rillaboom. Let's see. They withdrew Kyogre again to the Among Us? To the Regilecki again? What? We Grassy Glide into the Landorus and we play rough. Nice! Well done! Well done. They have Regilecki back out in the, in, in, in the field. But you guys, what, what you wanna do with that? Now you bring the Among Us. No, you still bring the Kyogre. You don't have the Among Us, right? Here I want to Grassy Glide into Regilecki and play rough it. So he might have a potential for Kasesh. Okay, they don't protect the Kyogre. Yeah, focus Ash there. Play rough again. So our Takufin is safe right now. Ice Beam. Well done. Well done. So I think we bring Takufini right now. And it's the couple tops. Okay. So they do bring the couple tops. Okay, so RMQ is here chilling. Two turns of Trick Room. What I, what I wanna do here? Focus on the Kyogre. Let's go double up into Kyogre. Maybe I could Dazzle Gleam. I just want to focus my damage into the Kyogre. Good damage. Lowering the special defense. Next turn we'll do more damage. Good damage. The Ice Beam. I think the choice. Ah, if you kill if you kill Mimikyu now, it just helped me. Liquidation. Please kill. Nice. Because now we have Calyrex out into the field. We can just high horse power the Kabu tops and uh, Shadow Ball the Kyogre. Shadow Ball Kyogre. High horse power Kabu tops. The, uh, they can double protect. No, the Kyogre, I think, is choice. I think his choice specs. Oh, no protects. Hyrule's power. Let's go. Super good. And now Shadow Ball should just wrap this up. Because we got the special defense drop. It, it was actually very useful. Because if, if you don't get that... We also did damage with the play rough. But if, if we don't have that special defense drop on the Kyogre... I don't think we we knock it out here on that on this turn. Then he attacks, Trick Room ends and he attacks again. But it didn't happen. And it was a great set of games. I want to check out that Kabutops. Landorus with the Sludge Bomb. Right, you can see there. Among Us with Spore and Pollen Puff and Rage Powder and Sludge Bomb as well. Kabutops, flip turn. Okay, it's like the Volt Switch. Rock Tomb, Liquidation, and Super Power. And you have Swift Swim. Yeah. Good, good attack. Ah, 
I wanted to see the Kyogre spread because that thing took too much damage. No, no. It didn't took too much dam damage from the play rough. W what happened, it, it was in the last games, Mimikyu was always intimidated. So my expectation of Mimikyu's damage was reduced because he was intimidated by the incinerators. But it's going to be all for today, guys. Thank you very much for your support. Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate you. Remember, we have Pokemon VGC here. We have Pokemon Mystery Dungeon and Pokemon Unite live streams as well. And join our Discord so you can know everything. Till the next time, I wish you the best thoughts, feelings, ideas and emotions. I wish you individuality so you don't lose your sanity. Until the next time, as a Cloud Surfer, surfing out. See you soon.